tell me about, from your perspective, where do typically companies go wrong in keeping their staff? So what are the common frustrations, pains that you hear from recruiters? Is it that they work for a manager who is a proper micromanager or doesn't empower them, they don't feel valued? Is it haven't had the right training? Where are companies falling short, you think? One thing that comes to mind, and it's trust. Especially with this whole work from home thing, it's caused a lot of politics in many companies, often because somebody maybe has not done a very good job working from home so as a result the whole team are not allowed to work from home anymore and the people are actually quite trustworthy and work very autonomously get really frustrated by that and I think as a manager one of the best things that you can do is show trust to your employees and make them accountable and not watch them that old school recruiting of like how many calls you made today how many calls you made today I don't think it works I don't and it's like you get results maybe yes for a certain amount of time looking at call time and analyzing it but ultimately showing them trust the results come out for themselves and the best companies are the ones who are not hiring and firing but they're the ones who coach to understand that actually you know what this role isn't for me and the person makes the decision themselves instead of on the firing line which creates fear uncertainty and negativity in teams. Mm. The Recruitment Mentors podcast is proudly sponsored by Vincherry and the award-winning Sourcebreaker.